What's going on everybody? Brink Entertainment here one more time again with great Android apps. I got another thing I want to show you. This is very resourceful and this is something that will help everybody out, especially if you're going from a new device and you just are not in, uh, you don't have the access to be able to get all of your apps transferred over. It's a great thing that you can do. So without further ado, let's get on into it. All right, so this right here is basically the feature of a Google Play Store that will allow you to get any app that you have currently or previously downloaded um, at all from the Google Play Store. Um, so if, let's say your phone broke and you just, there's no way you can get your apps over because, I mean, when you transfer your Google, when you, when you add your Google, your Gmail to the new phone, it doesn't pull your apps over. Um, not all the time. Now, Google is working on an update where once, I mean, it, they, it's currently in motion, but not every phone utilizes it yet, um, where you can actually back up your device from a previous device. Not every device does this, but Google has this in motion. But let's just say you're on one of those devices that will not allow you to um, restore or completely mirror your last device. So, if you're having that issue, this is all you're going to do. What you're going to do is you're going to go into the Google Play Store, as I did right here. And if you take your finger and drag from the left of the screen to the right, so you're going to slide your finger across and it's going to be a an option that pops up here. Now, this option right here, if you look where it says apps and games, under that you're going to see my apps and games. And you're going to click this and then you're going to tap the all tab. Now, what the All tab does is it shows you every app that you have ever downloaded from the Google Play Store, and it takes you all the way back to the very first app that you have ever downloaded. So if you had an app in the past, but you just can't remember what it's called, but you know you downloaded it at one time on a device that you had way back in the day, you can go back here and actually download the app once again because it has on record that you have downloaded the app and you def de and you technically own the, the the you own the app because you've downloaded it now I'm not saying you own it as if you own the rights to the app no that's not what i'm saying but what i'm saying is that you have downloaded it so it's tied to your gmail as long as your gmail is on the phone you have you can down potentially download the app again now it's not 100% guaranteed that if your phone is not compatible it will it download it maybe not but if your phone that you went to, the new phone, is now compa is still compatible with the app, then you can download the app. You probably see all this Minecraft stuff because that's my children on you know their phone that they're it's basically a phone I let them use, and they all got all this Minecraft stuff on here. It's, that's a lot of Minecraft. But basically, that's all the stuff they've downloaded. But pretty much, as you can see, it's everything that I've downloaded on my phone, uh, and uh, it's pretty resourceful. And uh, it's something that um, you you know definitely could take advantage of. Now, um, as you can see, it's a, the the menu here has everything from apps and games. It takes you straight to the menu for apps and games. You have the entertainment tab that'll bring up just movies, TVs, and books. Um, let's see, you have music, newsstand. You can have details about your accounts. You have your settings here, your wish list. So if you have apps that you want to purchase in the future, you can set them to your wish list and go back to them um, and not have to search for the app again. But it's a, it's a really great thing, and it's really useful and resourceful. So um, those who are interested in, in something like that, it'll help out when getting a new phone. Um, I'm glad. Thank you guys for watching. I'm glad you can tune into the channel. Um, if you're new to the channel, subscribe for more great Android apps. Um, also, I'm going to be uh, adding some new vlogs to my channel. So those who are interested in that, you can definitely partake in that. And feel free to leave a comment in the comments below. If you like this video, hit that like button. Like I said, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. If you want to see more, um, leave it in the comments below. If you got an app that you want me to review, uh, if you got uh, some ideas for anything, if you just want to just... You know, just chat or whatever, you know, leave me a comment in the comments below and I will be sure to respond to those comments. All right. God bless and thanks for watching and I will see you guys in the next video.